What's up everyone? Welcome to Crypto Maximalist. Before we begin, make sure to hit the like and subscribe and then hit the real subscribe button which is the bell icon. We're posting four videos every day so make sure to check back every single day. We're aiming for 20k subscribers and get a deal in the description if you haven't already. This is not financial advice. Welcome to Crypto Maximalist. Let's begin. What's up guys, so just before we begin, make sure to hit the subscribe and bell icon. People aren't seeing our content and that's probably because you haven't hit the bell. Thank you again for all your support. We're so proud of the amazing community that we've built. So we're just taking a look at Hedera Hashgraph here and as we can see, you know, it's been performing extremely, extremely well. Over the past few, over the past month or so really, hasn't it? You can see here, we wicked all the way back down onto the 55 here and we bounced really bullishly back onto the 20. This is a really, really bullish market structure on the daily time frame. And it really does show like the sheer amount of strength that Hedera Hashgraph has actually been having in the market recently. The fact that it can wick down onto the 55 two days in a row and then it can the candle comes all the way back up onto the 20 here and we get a continuation just shows how strong this uh, the you know the demand for Hedera is right now and we do seem to be having a bit of an alt season don't we with Bitcoin essentially having that drop and not really doing anything. We've seen basically everything in the market have a you know everything else altcoin wise in our own personal portfolio at least having an absolutely crazy pump and it, you know it's been it's been absolutely ridiculous hasn't it really really crazy price action in general and you know Hedera is no no exception it had that big correction a few days ago and it basically pumped all the way back up on the next day to where it was and you know had a little bit of a breakout here and now currently rolling over currently trading at around 32 and a half cents looking really really bullish so it basically tried to break out of this level here which we did outline in a previous video at around 33, 34 cents, is a, you know, this is a key level of resistance here, isn't it? And if you break this with some aplomb, we've obviously got, you know, the next price target realistically coming in at around 38 and a half cents. We've got four, this 41 cent level as well. And then obviously the all time high of around 45 cents, all really bullish. And you can see, you know, basically this is potentially, you know, a huge bull flag, isn't it? Which we talked about for a long, long time. And now that we're breaking up here, we do have that technical target of the top of the flag. And I mean, just for argument's sake, if we did see this come to fruition, we're looking at a decent little price target for, for Hedera here coming in at, at least, you know, 60, 70, <clears throat> 70 cents on the breakout. So things looking very, very bullish indeed. Hedera is, you know, showing a lot of strength, breaking out of all these key levels of resistance. And, you know, holding support like this is so, so bullish. It really just show the power of the, plat of the uh, demand for Hedera right now. And we do really think it's going to continue to do well. So there's not really much else to say, is there? You can see quite clearly, you know, we've got our range that we formed when we had the crash in May. We come down, we have a range looking something like this. And basically what's happened is we've traded downwards inside of our big you know, channel that we were trading downwards inside of. We're stuck under our EMAs. We bottom out here. W double bottom. We flip our EMAs into support again. We come up. We do something like this. We hit the top of the range. EMAs of support, top of the range, EMAs of support, EMAs of support again, we break out, we come down again, looking for that support, we wick all the way down onto the 55, the candles are holding st really strong here on the 20, coinciding with that previous level of the uh, range high resistance, flipped into support, and now that we've back tested this, I mean this is looking so bullish for continuation isn't it, when you see how we've back tested all of our levels of support with aplomb, this level here and this level here, and now it looks like we're going to get continuation, so Short term price predictions then, if we did roll over here, we're expecting, you know, if we come back down to this level here for this to hold at around 28 cents, coinciding with our 20 moving average really bullishly. And if we did get a big roll in the market temporarily, we've got the 55 coming in at around that 26 certain level as well. We'd strongly expect those levels to hold. And then upwards, uh, we're looking for price targets to the upside. Obviously, if we break this level here at around, what is this, 33 cents, we're looking for our next price target realistically in and around that 38 and a half cent, maybe upwards of 40, 41 and a half, 42 cents as our short term price predictions. And then if we just take a quick look at our FIB extensions of this recent move here, we just drag this from the top of here to the bottom of this little, uh, the wick here, you can see we've got some decent price predictions for Hedera. We obviously, once we break that all time high, which seems like more and more likely every day, we've got the 127 coming in at around 62 cents. The 141 coming in at around 75 cents, the 161 coming in at around 93 cents, 94 cents, and the 227 coming in at a very nice $2 here, which would be around, you know, a 4x of the all time high. But we do think Hedera has been, you know, it's been underperforming for a long time. And we do think, you know, we always said 5 to $10 was a more realistic price target. And, you know, considering how much this, uh, 
this uh, project does have the potential to pump it. I mean, from January to March, in two months, it pumped from, what is this, 3 cents to 45 cents? What is that, a 20x, a 15x? So just for argument's sake, if we did do a 15x from the bottom of this little move here, you can obviously see we're coming up to some nice price targets at around $2 as well. But we do think with the overextension of the bull market, we could be looking at more like three to five, maybe even $10 if we do get that crazy pump on fundamentals for HBAR. So that's it, guys. We'd like to thank everyone so much for their support. If you've got any questions or suggestions, please leave them down below. And don't forget to subscribe and then hit the real subscribe button, which is the bell icon to stay up to date with the four videos that we post every single day. Remember, if you want to support the channel more directly and get a ton of benefits and insight, as well as joining our growing community, consider the Patreon or YouTube membership down below. You can also sign up to our free Telegram via the description as well. All the links are in the description for affiliate links for discounts and free crypto. So go check them all out below. There's plenty of goodness on offer. Please like and subscribe. We are Crypto Maximalist.